This is a HeadGum Podcast. Welcome to Girls on Porn. I'm Rachel. I'm Laura. And we love porn. This is our porn review podcast. We talk about what we love and we roast what we hate. Helping you find hot, ethical, just plain better porn for your spank bank. And we're looking at everything. Before we introduce the topic, we have a scandalous little segment for you today. 69 69 seconds seconds of of sex sex news. news. We've pulled headlines from the news to keep you informed and horny. Here we go. A woman recently had a full body orgasm during a concert at the Los Angeles Philharmonic. Several concert goers reported seeing the woman moaning and writhing during Beethoven's Fifth Symphony. Onlookers confirmed that it was indeed an orgasm and not a medical incident. The woman has not been identified, but there is an audio clip of the moment. Absolutely virtuosic. There's a large dick iceberg off the coast of Canada. Photographer Ken Preddy captured a stunning photo of the unusually large ice formation, which bears a strong resemblance to a penis and balls. The photographer also happens to be from a town called Dildo. There are no coincidences in this life. Another new dating trend has emerged, zombied. Similar to ghosting, zombieing is where a partner disappears without a trace, but then reappears after a long period of time away to finally respond to your messages. You know, there is a reason we behead zombies immediately. We humans do not need those losers around. Most people in Utah no longer have access to Pornhub. A new law was enacted in Utah that creates a severe liability for porn sites that make their content available to people below the age of 18. In reaction, Pornhub is blocking folks with a Utah-based IP address out of an abundance of caution, fearing for those who violate the age restriction rules. MindGeek, the company that owns Pornhub, warns that these kinds of restrictions could drive traffic to sites with far fewer safety measures. If your people are going to sin, may they sin safely. Uh, True. You know, I got to say, I'm really excited to do this title, um, this search term, because I recently had a friend say to me. <laughs> I thought you were going to say you recently did a blow bang for the first time. No. I was so excited for that news to drop on this episode. I don't mind that you have Could you imagine? But... Oh, no. I'm uh, sad to say. Sad to report that. <laughs> no, personally, I have not done this great sexual feat. But I did have a friend recently say, he was like talking about how he was how he had sex with his wife. He was like, yeah, you know, I just had like a, a quick little blow bang. And I said, now, what do you think that term means? <laughs> <laughs> because I bet it's not what it actually means. And he thought that it meant when like a blow job leads to sex. And I said, no, sir, oh. that's just sex. <laughs> that's just sex. That's just sex. <laughs> that's just various sex acts in a row. That's just the order of things. <laughs> <laughs> Two things about that misunderstanding. First of all. So, like, I was thinking about the fact that blow bang and gang bang don't correlate, and we'll get to that later. But first, okay. blow bang, not fast, right? Because mm. nobody's getting dedicated attention. Like, both of these videos were so long. Yes. And I was, like, ready to be done with both of them because we got to give everybody a fair shot. We got to, you know, we got to suck on a dick Five dicks, you know? It's a lot of time. Well, similarly to a gangbang, exactly. you know? It's like, that's why all gangbang videos are like fucking hour and a half long. Yes. You yes, know? Exactly. Also, logistically challenging. I imagine yes. it's hard to get a group together. <laughs> it's hard to organize a fucking blowbang, you know? There's, I mean, it's, a, and a gangbang, you know? Yeah. You gotta what get people, people that are comfortable. It's about how difficult it is to align Google calendars for yes. your blowbangs. This doesn't it's get enough attention in the press. It's incredibly similar to a circle jerk, you know? People yeah. don't tell you that. Yeah. A blow bang is very... Because a majority of the time, you're just standing around in a circle yeah. with, like, someone in the middle. <laughs> Either and... jacking off or maybe yeah. someone's sort of tugging on your dick and right. sucking off. Right, Yeah. But mo- yeah. majority of the time, it's just a lot of blow bang videos are just, like, guys in a circle, like, jerking off. Yeah. St- trying to stay hard. Trying to stay for hard. For the love of God. And we'll get to it when we get to the videos, but... In some of these, Mm -hmm. they struggled. We saw some struggles on that front, you know. Which, you know, normalize. Normalize struggling. If no one's sucking on my dick, it's going to go soft sometimes, (laughs) you know? And I would know as I do have a dick. But um, (laughs) 
<laughs> should we give a quick definition? We should define it because I went immediately to thinking about blowbag versus gangbang. Mm. And you know Confusing, me. You see. I'm going to nerd yeah. out on the, the, the word. Of course. End, but. Um, okay, so this is um, <laughs> from... Wikipedia, uh, a sex act involving one individual performing oral sex on more than one man or person with a penis, uh, an orgy consisting primarily of acts of fellatio. Now, I will say that there was an urban dictionary. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I already know this uh, is definition. Be good. But what I appreciated about this one is that they also gave like the, like how to use it in a sentence. So I'm going to give you the definition <laughs> and then how to use it in a sentence. This please, is what Urban please. Dictionary gave me. I'm ready. Okay. <clears throat> in the same vein as gangbang, except instead of intercourse, the girl gives blowjobs to all the guys, often resulting in a mess of ejaculate on her face, in her mouth, or in her tummy. Preferred. <laughs> how to use it in a sentence. Dude, your girlfriend swallowed all my cum at the blowbang last weekend. <laughs> Oh, yeah? Mine, too. <laughs> Wait, say it in a sentence one more time. Sorry, I simply couldn't. I love it. I just want to make sure everyone gets to hear it. Dude, your girlfriend swallowed all my cum at the blow bang last weekend. <laughs> oh, yeah? Mine, too. I feel like that comes with, like, the illustrations of the textbooks we had, like the little yeah, cartoon absolutely. boys, like the teenagers being like, your girlfriend swallowed my load last week. Hey, mine too. High mine five. too. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Everyone's happy. I The only thing I take issue with about that definition was mm. just two being enough. I feel I like... Know. I know. Oh, you got to have at least four. <laughs> I would maybe let three slide. Sure. Two, is that a group? Is it a gang? You know I what mean, I mean? I mean, we need a group mentality like here. Like, two gonna... people have never rolled up to a bar, and we've been like, this gang the over gang here. gang just walked in. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's, you know? Yeah, no, I agree with you on that. I would I... say that it would have to be three, but four feels right. Yeah, four feels like the gold standard. Like, mm -hmm. you really gotta be doing four. Three, mm -hmm. like... You know, I mean, good for you. That's but, just um, a good time. That's... <laughs> Three's just you a know. casual conversation at a party, you know? Exactly. In my That's world. That's a Friday night. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Tuesday. Four. <laughs> um, I have some fun facts about the biggest blow bang in history. I would love those. Okay, cool. So um, it might not be in the Guinness Book of World Records, but on April 1st uh, in 2005, there was a new real world record set in Nashville uh, when Summer Knight uh, had oral sex with 249 men in a 14-hour period. Uh, the event was hosted um, by porn star Ron Jeremy, and, and it was filmed. It was sad that it, she didn't get to 250, but she was just too tired. She simply couldn't, she couldn't make it there. But you know what? 249, we'll give it to her. 249's amazing. Impressive. Like, why does it yeah. need to be a round number? 69 isn't a round number. 249 and can be its really own. people really like that one. Iconic <laughs> number, exactly. Exactly. Should we talk about why this is hot? Yeah, I'd love to. Like why people would be into it. I learned mm -hmm. some things. Okay. This episode that I didn't think I, I never think I can learn more and I always do. I mean, it's true. This is from an article called Why Men Like to Watch Other Guys Having Sex with One Woman at the Same Time. Mm. Somebody named Trey Lyon. I can't really advocate for the author, but I can advocate <laughs> for... The things that he references. So if yes. anything, he's like, he's linking to his research, you know, right. which which I appreciate. One highlight, obviously, there's much more of this for the men being in the majority versus the mm -hmm. women being in the minority. Yeah. In the porn space, like... Well, he, because the stats of gang bang and blow bang are pretty high in terms roof. of, like, who's watching them. Yeah. Yes. It's yes. mostly men. That's, yeah, exactly. That's sort of the surprise is that men really like watching a bunch of dicks in a circle, contrary. But you, you take the woman out of the, <laughs> out of the view, out of Suddenly frame. Suddenly it's not okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Suddenly the same guys aren't on board. Make hmm. that make sense. Questionable, you know? exactly. The math's not mathin. The math isn't mathin. <laughs> also, mm -hmm. researchers discovered, and the link there leads back to yes. Ethical Porn for Dicks, A Man's Guide to Responsible Viewing Pleasure by David J. Lay, mm. which feels like a, it's a whole book, so <laughs> yeah. we're leaning on more research here. Right. But research from that book shows that when a man watches porn with multiple men, mm -hmm. 
-hmm. versus regardless. any other kind of combination. Yeah, regardless of sexuality. Right? He yes. ejaculates harder. His ejaculate contains more sperm. And he gets erect again sooner. Hmm, interesting. Yeah. Now, what Trey here is drawing this in connection to yes. is sperm competition, which weirdly, okay. we've I don't think we've ever talked about the concept of sperm competition no. on this show. We haven't. But it's, I mean, it's a fascinating, fascinating subject. I also have to say that in researching this episode, I was looking at other words for sperm. Did you know that the full word for sperm is spermatozoan? I knew that from somewhere in the annals of my brain. Spermatozoan? Spermatozoan. I feel like there's an 80s movie with a sex ed teacher who says spermatozoan at some point. That's the full name. <laughs> it sounds like a dinosaur. Yes. Because of course it does. I, that sounds like we're talking about ancient times. Yeah. We're talking about the Paleolithic period. Yeah. Spermatozoan. Yeah. Well, speaking Get out of, of here. Yeah. part of the theory that they're connecting here is that group sex was quite common. Mm. And that there would often be like one female and multiple males. I yes. guess we're talking homo erectus or something. Yeah. And homo erectus, homo erotic. And I've heard this theory before mm -hmm. that the head of the penis um, potentially has the function to scoop someone else's sperm out of the <laughs> So what? sorry to just bring that on you. But you know, the idea that like going in and then the head is like, whoop, and just like goops it back. You know, like one of those Says, construction, you, hey, get out. like those construction scoops, <laughs> you know, that like go in. Or if you think about like the sand lot when they get that like crane over the fence that like scoops the baseball, yes. but then it like drops it at the last minute. Yes. I've heard crazier <laughs> scientific theories. Wow. <laughs> Wow. I also didn't know that, like, the fact that women are so vocal during sex uh, has roots in sperm competition as well. Yeah, like, is it about me, like, being more vocal for the man I'm enjoying the most? You know, am I... I'm rooting for yeah, my am team. Am I essentially, <laughs> am I, like, ranking the men by being like, you're doing great, yes. you're not so good. You know, like, is it... It's, like, literally, like, yeah. cheerleading on the receiving end, you know? Yes. You're cheering for your, your spermatozoan Is that team. also why we think cheerleaders are hot? Is that primal as well? Oh, wow. I'm really, I'm wow. grasping at straws is what we call this, but, um. Yes. Why not? But I appreciate you know? it. I, I have to say that I, like, I think that this all just kind of further confirms the theory that, like, we've all been having group sex for. Centuries. Centuries, since the beginning of time. Yes. You know, A hundred percent. A hundred percent. I like blow bangs. Okay. To watch? I do. Um, because I will have to say that as opposed to a gangbang, okay, the person that is that is directing the action has to be the person that's doing the blowing. That's a really valid point. I hadn't thought about that. They are directing the shot. They're directing the scene. They're choosing who they're going to. They're choosing like how they're they're sucking, and that's why I like it. You okay. know, whereas a gangbang can kind of feel like you're getting like tossed around a little bit, like a football. But like a blowbang, you're di directing the orchestra. You okay, know? so this goes back to the difference in the terminology that I wanted to nerd out on, mm, mm -hmm, but actually mm -hmm. justifies it in a helpful way. So, so gangbang, yes, the gang you see is about the majority party, is about the men mm -hmm. who are performing the acts on the women, assuming right. that we're talking about a female recipient, yes, in the gangbang, which is more common in the mainstream porn space, yeah. Whereas a blowbang refers to her action. You know, like yes. what she's yes, doing. Yes, what she's doing. So it actually holds with your observation that, like the f the woman, the minority performer, like the outnumbered right. party, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is active, right? And you also the outnumbered party who's doing the action. You know, in this case, in the videos that we'll talk about, it both of them are women. Yeah, they have to really for it for it to be a successful blow bag. They have to really enjoy giving head. And be very good at multitasking. Yes. They have to be really enthusiastic. They yes. really have to be dedicated. Because the camera will pick up on it. Exactly. You know? The camera will see if you're like... <sighs> yeah. You know? Like, right? But like for a good blow bang, they're going to be messy, spitty, you know, lots yeah. of saliva, lots of bodily fluids. Yeah. They have to really enjoy it. Yeah. And I think that it'll, it speaks to the success of one of the videos that we're going to talk about later. But yeah. Yeah. I do. I like a blow bang. I think that, like, you know, I'm someone who's pretty vocal about 
I enjoy giving head. So uh-huh. is that know. the main appeal for you that like it's about watching the blowjob itself or is it also about the woman being dominated or like outnumbered or her being the subject, the center of attention, maybe. Now I'm the just psychologically. Of yeah. Well, yeah. You, yes, you know, we all know how I feel about attention. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Looks to the camera. Um, yeah. It being the center of the attention and also being like so good at it that everyone's like, you're In so your good. ideal blow yeah. bang, she is revered. Yes. She is, she is the oasis to which we have come to suck. Exactly. Yeah. Not, you know, you can't be like, you know, mediocre. You can't give mid head at a blow bang. You can't. You know what I mean? I mean, <laughs> how's it going to end? <laughs> it's always, yeah, you'll be there forever or you'll just yeah. give up. Yeah. They'll leave. <laughs> it's true. It does have to be an incredible head because, yeah, you won't, you won't finish the damn job. Yeah. When I read that thing about the great, like the large, the 249 blow jobs, the detail that it was to completion in 14 hours. <laughs> think about 14 hours of blow jobs. I, I, an hour is as much when as was the last time you're you, were, you gave me. a blow job to completion also like that's <laughs> I do that know? periodically I make a point sure. it's a point of pride okay. but yeah now even you're so bragging. it's like well it's yeah. like you know even so it's like maybe every other week with a consistent yeah. partner it's not like every right. time you know right of course yeah yeah you got to be good at it you do and it does take dedication and it does and patience and that's just one dick Mm-hmm. You know, what if you hit the guy who's like got a shy pla- bladder isn't exactly shy <laughs> prostate. <laughs> sure. Shy balls. Shy balls. You um, know, shy, shy spermatozoa. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do the showdown? Let's Should do we show down? Sh- Let's shut down. Okay. First one from me. The Tampa Bay Blow Bang promo. <laughs> I love that it's like just... A, like, Super Bowl ad. <laughs> yeah, you could see it in lights. You yes. Know? <laughs> exactly. That's like, exactly Tampa right. Tampa Bay blow bang. <laughs> okay, first one for me. Uh-huh. Small tit honey cock sucks many. Oh. Almost poetry. We're giving it an almost. I don't know yeah. that I'm, like, all the way on board with this, but. <laughs> but they tried. Yeah. Um. Okay. It's all about TikTok blow bang. Uh, now, this would have me believe that it's a, that it's on TikTok, but I as, no way. as someone, yeah, I was like, Wouldn't as someone who's day. on TikTok, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no shot. They are the most sex, sex negative platform yeah. out there. You can't be, even show a vibrator. Yeah, you know, would be shut down immediately. I'm like, maybe they're all on TikTok at the same time while they're receiving a blow bang. Yeah, is it like heads up? Like you're just getting yeah. facial reactions to the blow bag of like, oh, that would be a good video. Hey. <laughs> Actually, sign me up. Now I'm coming around to it. The one guy with like resting bitch face. Um, yeah. Just ruining it for everyone else. Blow bang, frauded cocks come where they come best. <laughs> frauded? Yes. Now, how are we spelling frauded here? So it's spelled F-R-O-T-T-E-D. Ah, as in as in frottage. Yes. The British term to frott, which I don't know if you're familiar. That's dry humping. Yeah. That's dry humping. Yeah. So how does that, like, how does frottage work into a blow bag, I wonder? I mean, it sounds like we're doing some dry humping. She's rubbing outside the pants. But is she just maybe? rubbing her face? If it's <laughs> if it's a blow bag with frottage, is and she is just rubbing her face on like you know? their jeans? You is know? it a dog? <laughs> Get out of there! Also, where do they come best? <laughs> yeah, the cocks come where they come best. I don't know where that is in their jeans. If we're keeping them and on, and if someone knows, for the love of God, will you tell me? <laughs> <laughs> I'll watch it and get back to you. I won't. Thank you. <laughs> Um, the filthy whore from next door. Oh, more rhyming. Sounds like a good movie. I love it. It sounds like a good movie. Yeah, honestly, that sounds like a film. That sounds mm-hmm. like an adult film from the, the filthy whore from porn. next door. It also yeah. sounds like or a, a dirty book. or a yeah a Pulp Fiction cover. A Pulp Fiction, you know? yeah, like the dirty whore from next door, and she's oh, there like, she is. She's like holding Not a glass wearing of lemonade. Stockings. Yeah, no <laughs> stockings. Her dress is undone. She's mm-hmm. sweaty. I don't know. Yes. She's giving it a she's strong breeze would just make it fall <laughs> off the shoulder. Just pop a tit out, you know? Mm-hmm. I exactly. have one more. Fuck Maching Blowbang. <laughs> Fuck Maching. 
No idea. M a c h i n g, matching. Someone will. Matching. S- someone's gonna know what it is, and they're gonna send us a message about it for sure. They never do, Rach. I always they, hope. Sometimes they do. Okay, so it is a fuck machine. So I've opened it. Ah, it's, it's a, a fuck, fuck machine. machine. So we meant an E instead of a G. We were so uh, close. We did our best. Mm. We fell Wait, a little a blow short bang with fuck machines. It looks, now that person must love giving head because it's not even for the benefit of the other person. So what it actually looks like is uh-huh. she's getting fucked by a fuck machine while sucking the dicks. You see, ah, uh, okay. so so we're getting creative here. We're incorporating man v machine, uh huh, or just machine and man working together. You know, she's mm-hmm. pleasuring man, for machine is goal. pleasuring her. You know, it's a cycle. <laughs> like the, the expansion of the Great Railroad. <laughs> um, okay, last one for sure. me. <laughs> Man and machine working together. Uh, double barrel blow bang. Double barrel. Do you know what that is? No. Two dicks, two dicks in a mouth. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see. Double we we kind of get that in one of the yeah. videos that we talk yes. about later. Yeah. Yeah. How wide can you go? Different ways to go in, you know? Yes. Like, are they stacked? Are I, we? One would think that stacking man, would be. You'd think, but then you'd have to think about the logistics of what the jaw. men have to do. Yes. And also like, your does, jaw. Does the man have to straddle the other man and go on uh-huh. his tippy toes above <laughs> yeah. him so that their dicks can stack? <laughs> go <and> underneath. <laughs> Or are we simply side by side and just really angling our dicks? We, I think this way. that's how it's going to have to go. <laughs> the idea of a, someone with their legs spread and another man coming up underneath to get his dick directly underneath his um, to stack on top. It's somehow really sweet. It speaks to camaraderie. It a speaks totem to pole commitment. Of, of dicks. Yeah. Wow. A human centipede of yeah. dick stackage. <laughs> It's sweet. Why is it sweet to me? I'm like, look, they're trying so hard to get both their dicks in. Teamwork. Uh, we're just, you know, we're slowly peeling away the homophobia. We're tr- we're trying to peel away the we're looking for any yes. We're looking yeah. for any chance for the men in this blow bag to like touch their genitals just a little bit. Yes, it's <laughs> yeah. gonna be okay. I like the idea of the top guy's butt just gently resting on the bottom <laughs> guy's. <laughs> Lower cock, you know? <laughs> Maybe his little butt is tucked into his little poop fupa, you know? Like they're just sweetly kind of spooning a little while they try to get their dick in the girl's right. mouth. It's chill. It's sweet. It's yeah. nice to imagine. <laughs> Should we take a break? Let's take a break. <laughs> My wife's first blow bang. Um, this is a little channel from New Sensations. We found it on Adult Time. Mm-hmm. And um, they got some really great blow bang videos, um, as the title would suggest. <laughs> uh, it stars Emily Willis, who we've actually never talked about before, but she's one of my favorite mainstream porn performers. She's incredible. Um, I wasn't aware yeah. of her, and I went down a rabbit yeah. hole last night. So we'll talk I about her at length. really love her. Yeah. Um, also, we've got Tommy Pistol, Mark Zane, um... Cody Steele, Eric Masterson, Chad Alva. Mm-hmm. Um, also, yeah. important to note, my wife's first blow bang, scene two. Oh, sure. Which is helpful to note because they establish in our exposition that she's had blow bangs before, ah. but not with this many guys. Yes. Right? So we, yeah. So we start on like a little exposition. Yeah. Um, where Emily's trying on her lingerie, her, her, <laughs> Her husband comes in and he's brought her like four wilted roses. <laughs> She's like, thanks. You yeah. immediately detect a lack of enthusiasm, which is a choice yeah. we learn. But originally right. I was like, wow, she's not that excited to get flowers. Like that would be special to me. But right. she's like, thanks, babe. But then we find out her hesitation is because there are four, four roses? Four roses for the four men that will be joining. But he, including him, it's five. Including me, it's five. They say that. Yes. 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 Now, I hated this. This is the only part of the video I hated. But the reason I hated it is because he was like, she was like, I don't know. Am I ready for, I can't like, yeah, she was immediately nervous and resistant to the idea of that many dudes. (laughs) And then he was like, you can fucking do it. What are you talking about? Like, you're ready. He manipulated her into it. Why is it his decision that, you know, like it would have been such an easy flip. 
for him to bring her the damn roses and whatever this dumb idea of like one for each dick you'll suck. Yes, and she's stoked on it. But then for her to be like, fuck yeah, I said I'm ready. You th- you ready to watch me? Yeah, like I wanted it to yeah. be her idea. Same, agreed. That's so the only easy. thing that I didn't like. You could have done yes. a thousand different things just to make it about mm-hmm. her being excited to take that many dicks on. Right. Right. Rather than being scared and him being like, you can do it. Forcing then, her into it, yeah. Because then, for the rest of the blow bang, when the guys are like, come on, come on, come on, come on, don't give up, you know, like, it doesn't feel, yeah. it feels like pressure as opposed to support. Right, you know right. What I no, mean? I hear you. And but it just her barely performance... took me out. She's incredible. Yes, yes. It, we literally chop off those first 30 seconds, and yeah. I'm like, this is amazing. Mm-hmm. And they do a lot of, they make a lot of other choices that sort of cancel out that weird, not very feminist yes. moment at the top, right? Exactly. I agree. I agree. After the little exposition, we do get a kind of fun scene where he, like, makes her, like, touch herself in front of the mirror and, like, spit on herself, spit on the the reflection and lick it up, which I was like, okay, hot. Creative. I'd never, (laughs) whoever thought to spit on a reflection. I've had spit in my mouth and vice versa. Right, Right. but to spit on your own reflection. Yeah. I was like, that's horny. Yeah. (laughs) Actually. (laughs) That's horny, actually. And then we move to the bedroom and she starts to... Uh, give head to her husband mm-hmm. as like a warm up. You know, yep, we're yep. opening up the jaw. <laughs> he gestures, and then the five headless men, <laughs> four headless men, come in. Our four headless dick men, yes, come galloping into the yes. room. What I do love is that throughout this video, a sixth star <laughs> is also present, which is yes. the Hitachi Wand. Our favorite porn performer. So yes. she, even though it is a blow bang and it's about everyone else getting to come, she comes like four times. Yes. You know. Crucial. Even yes. before they walk in, like he's, yes. he pulls out the Hitachi when they're like warming up yeah. for the blow bang. And I was like, oh, fuck yeah. Like yeah. we're looking out for her from go. And right. I thought it would go away. I thought it was just like, you can come now and then you suck all of us off. And I was like, sure. No. A little tit for tat. But they're, like, incorporating that thing throughout. It is very much about her pleasure as well. Yes, very much Which so. I really loved. It's yes. about her pleasure. And it also brings out, like, she gets, like, so rare and to go that she's, like, animalistic. Yes. You know? Yes. And she's, like, ferocious, like, grabbing that. Like, that's what I mean. Like, it's, like, so, like... The like passion. primal. Yes. Yeah. The yeah. passion, the believability of, mm-hmm. like, her determination to, like, yes, really choke off every dick. Yeah. Let's talk about Emily Willis. She yeah, I'd love to. is supermodel hot, like gorgeous. Looked her up on Instagram. She's Kendall Jenner as a porn star. <laughs> you know, I mean, she's even more like petite and like yeah. She looks like that one fucking Victoria's Secret angel I kind of had a crush on for a few years. Like she's. <laughs> I don't remember her name. For a few so, years. Okay, so it wasn't well, a very fervent yeah, crush. A, yeah. <laughs> She'd just pop up and I'd be like, pretty girl, and then move yeah. on with my day. But like brunette, you know, sun-kissed fucking skin, right. whatever you want to fucking she looks say about very, it. She looks pretty natural, too. Yeah. Like, yeah. She kind of looks like... I guess that's the difference between Kendall Jenner and her is I'm right, like, I feel right. like her body's no. her body. Right. And even like her face and her nose is her face. Like she has like a scar between her eyes that I mm-hmm. clocked. And mm-hmm. I don't know why I, I like that. Like a little human flaw, you know? Yeah, she looks like a hot girl that you'd walk by on the street. You know? And you'd be like, that girl's hot. Yeah. But not someone that like is so like that person doesn't exist in nature, you know? Uh huh. Yes. Not a robot, but just strikingly beautiful. Listen, we both want to fuck her. Yeah, we're horny for Emily Willis. Emily, if you're listening. I live in Los Angeles. Slide yeah. into the DMs, uh, and she's a she's an incredible performer. Too. Yeah, we get she's in, she's incredible at deep throating. We get a lot of like laying on her back, like upside down deep throat situation. Yeah, which takes a lot. Like yeah, yeah, and uh, everyone comes. Yeah, and there's like some choking. I was like, I knew exactly. I was like, oh yeah, Tommy pistols in this scene. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I I spot the way he fucks from a mile away. You yeah. Know? <laughs> yeah. I was like, I know him. <laughs> you know all the hat tricks. <laughs> yeah. You know what to expect yes. from your favorite all stars. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. And yeah, I there's not too much to talk about because it's pretty like it's a hot video. Clear play by play. Yeah. It's a hot it video. Wasn't... It's basically like, yeah, the weird part is when he just summons the men. They're also yeah. all, by the way, like wearing a uniform. They're all dressed like finance bros. They're all in like business casual button downs yeah. and like slacks. Yeah. Um, it's his friends from the office. 
<laughs> it's his friends from the office. You know, that's right. That's how you organize your blow bang. You just get your team, you know? Right. But her enthusiasm just like sustains itself through the whole video. Right. Right. And then it seems like as we progress too, it like becomes more about her pleasure. Like it almost feels like she earns the Hitachi coming back or them mm. then like flipping the script on her and making it about her pleasure. Cause we finished yes. the video with like one guy, I think her husband going, her husband, her supposed, yeah. her fake husband. In this, in this world. In the her character world. husband yeah. going down on her, somebody else like playing with her tits. Other guys just like jerking off. Her still like sucking two guys off. Uh-huh. But she's like the center lying down. Right. And then they all just like come on her. And right. And she loves it. Yeah. It's a great video. It's a great video. We could just chop the first 30 seconds off and then I'm fully on board. <laughs> yes. Hard agree. Um, yeah, I really, I'm glad, I'm glad that we did it. It's a video that I've, I've watched before and I was yeah. like, if we're going to do blow bang, we're going to do this vid. So yeah. thank you for pulling it. I had a suspicion yeah. that you had one in mind when we were talking about videos. I was like, Rachel, <laughs> I'll leave the door open for something you've masturbated to, I'm sure. <laughs> yep. And here it was. Happy to bring it to the table. Um, should we talk about Midsummer Celebration in Sweden? Blow bang with Swedish Fel- Felici? Yeah. What do we think that is? Felici? 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 I, I don't know. Swedish Felici, I yes. believe, is her name. The performer's name. So this is near as nightmarish as Midsummer, <laughs> the movie. We open on a, a silent walk through a grassy knoll. Uh-huh. Also four men. Four men. Felici is is leading them, holding their hands. Yes. Just ring kind around of, the rosy. Ring around the rosy, kind of walking through the grass. There's a cross. Yeah. Really striking to see a cross in porn. <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's gonna burn my in, eyes. Covered in ivy, adorned in ivy. Without saying a word, this is one of the quietest porns we have watched in a truly, long time. I thought, that, I thought it was on mute. I was like, what's going on here? But yeah, silence, like the silence of the wood. <laughs> pervades the entire fucking film. Are the, is anyone having fun? <laughs> Couldn't tell you. Couldn't tell you. And then she just like walks them in a sort of weird like snake shape and then mm-hmm. sort of brings them into a semicircle and then just comes to her knees right, and starts to suck them uh, without off. I was going to say suck them off, but no, she doesn't. No. It's so strange because to put these videos next to each other, I'm like, I don't think that this girl likes to give head. Yeah. You know, there's a missing sort of animalistic primal enthusiasm there. The je ne sais quoi, you know? Also, I was like, is she dehydrated? Like, I want more spit, you know? like She spit, I think, once. Yeah. Like, three quarters of the way through a very long porn for what it is. Yeah. I thought it was going to be like five minutes and it just kept going. Get messy. Yeah. Yeah. One of the guys who also happens to not show his face. We've got a (laughs) guy blurred out throughout. Cannot get his dick hard. Who is he? He's just... Why must he be blurred out? Something tells me he works for the government. Yeah. You know, that's where my mind went. My mind was like, this is trusting, because she definitely Mm. has you on camera. Uh You know, you're just trusting her to blur you out. So I did weirdly respect that. I was like, she respected... His he wishes. Said no. Yeah. It looks fucking weird because like the blur blob will like follow him, him and then like blur yeah. her out and blur other guys out because we mustn't see no. this one sort of frumpy mm-hmm. middle-aged guy who can't get a stick up, unfortunately, even yeah. under the best of circumstances, you know, is kind of yeah. tugging at it, just not having much luck there. Right. She's also got a flower crown on. Ah, uh, we forgot about this part. Yes. Early on, we're like a minute in. Blow job, flower crown off, mm-hmm, fallen down. Mm-hmm. Did not think yes. about that logistical challenge right, in planning right. for this. We needed to pin it in place. Yeah, your head is going to be moving around a yeah, lot. Yeah, the secret to know about flower crowns is you often have to pin them in place. True. Anybody True. who's tried to dance at a wedding as a flower girl <sighs> or been to the Ren Fair and gotten a little excited for a turkey leg knows that. Right. You, you know? know? Dance to jig. <laughs> <laughs> but at the end of this, something tells me that the guy that's blurred out is important because at the end of it, she like like wags her finger at him and is like, no, 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 like you're naughty and like pushes him aside. Ah. Oh. And then uses her flower crown to either like toss, to do a we ring toss. We played dick toss at the end. Yes. Yeah. And it didn't get on one guy's and it did get on the other guy's. And the, yeah. the, the guy that won the dick yeah. toss, she like takes his hand and skips away and it's like tune in for part two and I 
thought, no, I'm good. <laughs> I'm all set. I've seen. No, I think I'm fine. <laughs> I've seen enough. Also, I don't want to dick shame. You sure? But it did feel odd that like each dick we were introduced to was like stranger than the last. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like I did would, write down. I said, what a, what, a, what a varying degree of shapes and sizes here. Yes, we had a real diversity of dicks. And it started with like, that's just an average dick to like, oh, sure. that's a really thick dick to uh-huh. like, oh, that one comes to a point and has kind of stalactite. a... Stalactite. A, a stalactite or an icicle or like E.T.'s yes. finger. It has like a sure. nubbin at the end uh-huh. of it that is uh-huh. has... A, has it's like the circumcision went wrong. It's, it has. But yes, but it's nice to be reminded that they come in all shapes and sizes. Yeah, listen, I don't want to. Which, frankly, we don't get enough of in mainstream porn. We it's get true. We see one type of large penis. Yes. I didn't, I certainly didn't mind the size. It was sure. just like, wow, we really have different shapes. I know. And I wonder what the casting attitudes. process was like. <laughs> <laughs> I think the casting process was whoever she could find. Sure. Based on Fair. the fact that one of the guys just fully didn't show his face. You know, <laughs> yeah. she was like, listen, you can fuck me later if you do this video, but, yeah. you know. Or it was his kink to be excluded from stuff. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Also, a lot of weird cuts were like, she was on this dick and then we like cut and she was suddenly over here working on right. these two dicks. And I was like, yeah, the continuity does feel important. I know. I wrote down. I was like, she's she's playing favorites. Yeah. Yeah, she like if like <laughs> when she sort of started on the dick that was not hard, she gave up within three seconds. Like it wasn't yeah. like, oh, let me really see if I, it was like, uh, you know, yeah, like just yeah, kind yeah. of brushed it off, um, which again, you know, doesn't speak to that level of dedication, that passion, mm-hmm. that enthusiasm, mm-hmm. that generosity mm-hmm. that we're looking that we for. saw from Emily. So just hard to follow. I know. Emily Willis is hard to follow. Or do either of these go in your spank bank? What do you think? I think that the Emily Willis could. Yeah. yeah. I almost want to like go further down her rabbit hole and find See what else other, she's working with. Because I'm sure there's other stuff. Because she was the reason for the season, you know? Right. Yeah. Nothing that the guys was doing were doing was mm-hmm. like special to me. Sure. So I'm like, sure. maybe there's a different blow bang with her. But that's even why you just watch different blow porn. bangs. That's why you watch them. It's for what the, the person what the, that's doing the blowing. Yes. You know, you watch Our it Our outnumbered them. party as we labeled yeah. her before. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Try to be inclusive. Yeah. And it sounds like Emily's blow bang is already in your spank bank. Yeah. Yes. Firmly. Yes. Should I appropriately Guilty. assume that Swedish Felicity no, is I, not? Yeah. <laughs> that didn't do anything for me. Yeah. Um, unfortunately. But yeah. love to the Swedes. Love to the Swedes. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, thanks so much for listening to Girls on Porn. You can find us on Instagram at TikTok at Girls on Pern. That's porn without the O. On our Twitter at GOP the Podcast. On our website at girlsonporn.com. And also on our Patreon, patreon.com slash girlsonporn. Don't forget to rate, review, and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to leave us a cheeky little five-star review, you can drop your Instagram handle so we can tag it and thank you. This has been Girls on Porn, the only GOP that's actually any good. That was a HeadGum Podcast.